Hi there! You ask for the difference between ultimately and eventually. So here it is. I'm going to start by adding one more word. Initially. Initially, eventually, ultimately. And I'm also going to add a couple of equivalent expressions. At first, in time, or with the passage of time, and in the end. These sets of phrases can start you off on understanding the difference. To use an example in the popular fairy tale Beauty and the Beast, initially she feared him, eventually she came to trust him, and ultimately she fell in love. We can tell essentially the same story with this alternate set of phrases. At first, she feared him. With the passage of time, she came to trust him. In the end, she fell in love. To tell you a little more about both of these words, eventually and ultimately, they suggest a certain amount of uncertainty as to when or how the events occur. It's not like a determined sequence, like, uh, like the life cycle of a frog. Initially, it's an egg. Then it hatches. Finally, it becomes a frog. Finally is the word you would use when you're more certain of the outcome. With ultimately, it's not important how or when the events developed beforehand. We only know it's how this story ends. Like this expression. Both sides fought for many years, and ultimately, the rebels won. And one more difference eventually is used only when we're talking about the passage of time. Ultimately can be used when we're talking about a logical development. Here are some provocative conclusions. Ultimately, philosophy is more realistic than religion. Ultimately, the scientist and the artist have the same goal. Ultimately, the prophets have little to say. Ultimately, Picasso is superior to Van Gogh. And don't worry, I'm not trying to talk you into anything. I just like to make up lively examples. But there's one more element that determines when to use ultimately and when to use eventually, and that is context, your meaning. Let's look at, uh, let's look at this question. Will I die? There are two correct answers. Ultimately, yes. Eventually, yes. What's the difference between these two? The context for this answer is your story. If you're a typical human being, then initially you're born, eventually you grow old, and ultimately you die. We don't know when or how or what happens in between, but we know that these things happen. But if your context or your meaning is a much longer timeline, then you use eventually. Eventually you will die and your children will take your place, and the world will go on. In this timeline, perhaps ultimately you will be remembered in myth and legend, or perhaps ultimately you'll be forgotten. So listen out for those two words, eventually and ultimately, when you watch the news or movies or YouTubes, and see if you can tell the difference in the context. I've kept this brief, so if you have any remaining questions, go ahead and ask them in the comments. You know that eventually I will answer. Thank <laughs> you.